Christmas as you remember it. A long time ago, there was an enchanted village. Everywhere you looked, it was Christmas. And inside each house, you could see families getting ready for Christmas Day. The enchanted village that once was, is once again an entire floor of Jordan Marsh in Boston, now through December 31st. Show your family Christmas as you remember it. That's why our basket is full. <laughs> this is for my granddaughter. Two ninety nine. <laughs> Whatever your banking needs, we can help. We can help with savings and checking and all kinds of loans. We can help with retirement and pension plans for you or your business and profit sharing too, and trust services, and services for the professional community, and for businesses big and small. When it comes to your banking needs, we can help. We're Maine National Bank. Crack. It'll do it to First time out. And once you start cracking, you don't stop. Crack, not even once. Open camera and stereo. Open camera and stereo. Open camera and stereo. But here, the future is also taking shape. As the Republic progresses, the population expands, and the quality of life continues to improve. The city grows, but not in a random manner. 
And in the section called El Beya, President Saddam Hussein and the Baghdad Municipal Authority, Amanat al Asima, share a vision of a new community where all the necessities of Iraqi life will be provided for the residents of the 2,000 housing units in the new Saddam neighborhood. Everybody knows of John Kerry the senator and the presidential candidate, but John Kerry the bassist? Yes, the senator has a rock and roll past in the rhythm section of a high school garage band called The Electress. And this little known prep school garage band may have remained forever in obscurity. If last September Eric Lindgren and his assistant had not paid attention to the picture on an album cover purchased at a yard sale in the early 80s. I said, is that John Kerry? And he said, yep. That's John Kerry. Yeah. So as a Kerry supporter and flea market connoisseur, Eric made a beeline for the presidential contender himself, winning potential antique roadshow points by getting John Kerry's John Hancock on his own band's LP. There was a, a John Kerry fundraiser that I went to. So I pull this album out of the box and I start waving it above my head. He grabbed the album from me and he went, where did you get this? I a tough find indeed. 